How's it going guys? Coach Pat here. It's about 5 a.m. in the morning and we're with military crew and we have Paul and Donna and they're kind enough to help us figure out how to carry oars and set them up on the dock. So for all of you guys in the Charles River Rowing League, um, this is what you've been working on over the past two weeks. So guys, go ahead and take it away. Awesome. And so, Paul, how do you know which oars to take? Military crews assign yellow stripes and they're, they're banded on the top of the oar. So All right, so he just said that his coach, me, told him to take yellow stripe oars. And so he's got four yellow stripes. Awesome. And Donna, what are you doing? Exactly, right? So we don't want to bang them around. We want to prolong the life of the oars. And so uh, what is that crazy contraption you got going on there? So we have a sling here. A sling, awesome. We get our eight oars, and then we get two people. We're, we're good with eight. Wait. And then we get two people to carry them down if you want to. Beautiful. And we got Phil to help us out here too. So, uh, Paul, why is it important to keep the blades, the red... Why is it important to keep the blades off of the ground or from hitting anything? The blades scratch easily, you get the, get the paint, paint on them that has the, uh, the CRI logo on it, so you want to keep them up so they don't scratch against the ground or on the dock or whatever. Awesome. The handles have take a little more abuse, but not, not the blades. Okay, cool. Thanks, Paul. Right. And what dock are we going to today? Dock number three? three? Dock number three, all right. You guys get beautiful sunsets in the evening, while well, we also get beautiful sunrises in the morning. Welcome to uh, 5 a.m. at CRI. And so how do we try to arrange them? So tips so, down, so beautiful. So don't ruin the paint. Awesome, so we don't ruin the paint. We prolong the life of the ore. Right, and... We try to stack them neatly. Yeah, so when people grab them, they're not all twisted. So it's a little bit easier, a little bit faster to grab them. And uh, how about, Phil, where do we put them on the dock, and why? Uh, in, indoor in front of the river, so that we have a uh, place to walk on the yeah, so we want plenty of room to walk along the dock so the oars are out of the way. We might actually, guys, if we can tuck them over a little bit more, they're a little, a little out of the way, maybe, maybe stack them. And never on the apron. Exactly, never on the apron. Well, I hope you guys learned a lot. Um, we'll see you next week for week three of the league. Thanks, guys.